Dream Team, it's your boy D Neil back with another reaction video, guys. Here we are with NBA Finals 1992 Game One, first quarter. You guys asked for the '92 Finals next, so here we are. We got MJ, we got Drexler. They finna go at it, and I just want to say I don't know what happened between '91 and '92, but I can already see that the quality is a lot better. In these 92 finals. So I don't know what happened with the recording and everything going on. But these finals look like it's going to be a lot clearer of quality than what we saw in the 91 reactions. Let's do this. For the opening tip. Bill Cartwright steps in to go against Jerome Kersey. And it's controlled. Well deflected out. And it will be Portland ball. Last touch. By Chicago. <laughs> Terry Porter being played by John Paxson. Hey, the sniper. The John Paxson. Michael Jordan facing Clyde Drexler. Oh, they fighting down there. Kevin Duckworth going at Bill Cole. Oh, we got Kevin. Yes. Okay, Kevin. Okay, Kevin. Kevin said from the jump, he lunch me, dog. Bill Cartwright finna be lunch me. This okay. Basketball game gets the first basket for his team, the first hoop of this championship series. It's got to be a tremendous confidence builder for this young man. Good pump fake, man. Great pump fake. This past season, I think you can look for both teams to go inside early. The game won't be as fast in the probably in the first half as it, as it will in the second half. So look for both teams to go inside. Hey, Maggie on the commentary squad. Local product out of Harvey, Illinois, who had to garner up a host of tickets for tonight's game, giving Portland a 3-0 lead. Cartwright. The board. Box out by Percy. Here comes Drexler. And one. Clyde! Clyde the Glide! Oh, good call. Good call. Concentration and convert, even though the foul takes place. One thing the fans gonna have to look for here is the fact that in the last two series, Michael didn't have to play defense. In this series, he will have to play defense all the time. And what happened that time? Michael went to the offensive boards last time. Down, got caught on the oh, that person. Okay. Oh, good look. And one. Hey, come on. What's up with the put? And one. Good look, Mike. Line drive jump shot with Clyde. Clyde. Illegal defense. Some of the great ones have the ability to elevate and then see the entire floor. Michael that was such a great look. And then finds Pippen underneath. What we got, Scotty? You're too big. Okay, Clyde! Clyde ain't playing with y'all. Good call. You should have shot it. You should have shot it. And very quickly, the Bulls have collected three team fouls. This a non-shooting foul. Phil Jackson wants I guess the rap put forth by the struck to motivate him and said floor room who they are we're gonna skip Playoff back to series. the game uh, I'm sorry uh, that just doesn't hold water if that's the case then there's an awful lot of teams that are really struggling in this league mm -hmm. right off the steal Paxson finding cash the shooting the three the save by Cartwright and Grant 
was fouled. Called on Percy. Well, Marv, talking about what Co Coach Adelman just talked about. Yes, it's out there, and it is in the back of their mind. I think in game six of the Utah series, they needed to win that game in a close game to say, okay, we can win close games. I caught right, setting up on Duckworth. Good call, good call. Kevin Duckworth. Well, Cartwright, who has had a dreadful time of it at the free throw line, will shoot a pair. That's because that four, the four me guy. That's why he done had a bad time. A very solid free throw shooter in recent years with the Bulls. 60, 37 percent. Yeah, day. 36 percent from the line for Cartwright during. Look at, come on, bro. But you know why, Marv? When he was with New York, they went to him a lot. He got to the foul line a lot, and he got a chance to get in a groove and in a rhythm. Now, the Bulls do not go to him. He don't get to the line a lot, and his, and his free throw percentage falls off because of that. Well, he's just helped his percentage immensely. Good look. Two out of two. Here's Why pressure you? by Chicago. We saw very little pressure. That defense, man. Against Cleveland. No, and this is exactly what they want. They had Buck Williams and Kersey backhand on the ball near the half court line. And Terry Porter, who has been on fire during the Terry, okay. To convert. Blazers nine, Bulls four. And that's a good sign for Terry Porter because in the two games this season against Chicago, he was shooting just over 31% against the Bulls. Oh, my. Too easy. Mike said I do this. Good look. What's the Jordan at the offensive end of the floor, the ability so to nice. long enough to get that good look at the front of the rim. Tremendous concentration by Michael. But Clyde Drexler said that's what they want. They want to force Michael to the middle, to the help. They accomplished that, but Michael still scored. And then you saw the quick, long pass back, trying to get a score in transition. I talked to Paxson before the game. I said, do you want to run up and down with these guys? He looked at me like I was crazy. No way, he said. We have to be selective when we run against this team. Buck Williams called for a second. He's replaced by Cliff Robinson. Well, we got Mike. Shot clock at five. Here's two. No. Good defense. The dribble off his foot. Three on two. Here we go. Clyde, Clyde really, Clyde really do be gliding out here. Okay, Clyde. Clyde Drexler at his best in the open floor, hitting for his. Okay, Clyde. And Portland with an 11-6 advantage. Marv, nobody better leave their TV set because it's going to be some great plays in this series. I gotta see that again, bro. because when you get a guy who can take it at six seven, lead the break, and then just he was six seven. I didn't know Drexler was that tall. Portland has had its first five from the field. Another substitution for the Blazers. Mark Bryant, four-year man from Seton Hall, replacing. Kevin Duckworth, who has picked up two fouls, so two apiece on Duckworth and Williams. Caught right being played by Brad. Jordan shooting the three. And he off right play. now. Good look. Making contact with Paxson, crowd looking for a foul, and it was knocked out of bounds by the Trailblazer. And, and Clyde Drexel caught Paxson on his back in the lane in transition, just posted him up, looked for the long lead pass, just lost control. Good look. Good. Oh, my God. Great looks. Passing is on point. Not many big people are willing to be interior passes, but this Bulls team plays so unselfishly. They're always looking for each other. And the key thing is they know where they are supposed to be on the floor they find their teammates because they're in the right spots oh wow not doing much what we were talking about earlier both teams want to go inside there hasn't been many jump shots and both are trying to establish their game right now and bill cartwright has hit his first three, three for three from the free throw line
outside official Hugh Hollins indicating a lane violation that Cliff Robinson stepped in. To Let me see you. You may leave and step over the line. Oh, okay. At least you can see there the ball's clearly in contact. Yeah, I see He's it. All the way across in the lane. Let's well, see. That's Bill Cartwright's. Watch it. What high shoots? He comes up with it and then releases. Where most free throw shooters, they come through all in one motion. He has two motions. Little head fake by Cartwright. Jordan able to keep it. Cash. Oh, the sniper don't miss. For Jordan. And the Bulls here in the early going shooting the three pointers. They have not been a team normally that looks for the downtown shot. While Portland there you go. And the Bulls have been off the mark. Only two of ten in this first quarter. Terry Porter. Terry, it's like that, Terry. Terry, it's like that. Oh, yeah, we ain't see this in the 91 finals. We ain't see nobody coming down, pulling up from the three like that. Oh, this is a different ball game. Okay. Okay. Oh, it was a long two. They fly the jump shooter's man on the shot. He does not have box out responsibility. So long rebounds will come back to Good look. Shoot it. What you doing, Scotty? Four second violation. Good defense, Portland. Sometimes it's just a matter of inches between the two and the three. That's a three. Touching the white line, which that's a three. It is only a two, not a three. I didn't get to see it zoomed. It looked like a three to me. See how Clyde Drexler is playing Michael Jordan. He's not up on him. He's playing like two feet off when he's enticing him to take that jump shot. And right now, Mike is over two from out there. And let's see what happens during the course of the game. Cliff Robinson. Yes. Nah, all right. Portland's a much different team than the Lakers. And I'm only like five and a ten. Much different team than the Lakers. I watch Lakers, no perimeter game, was killing in the post. I watch in Portland, they like that perimeter. They like that, but you haven't really seen much post work besides the first play of the game. They like that perimeter. Lasers have hit their first seven field goal attempts. It's Portland 15, the Bulls 7. Five minutes gone by. Oh, that would have been nasty. You got to make that. Oh, got to finish, though. Foul, yes, good call. Somebody hit him. One of y'all hit him. Oh, it's against Porter. Quick outlet pass. Porter trying to slow up that Bulls fast break attack. And that's one of the things that Cleveland tried to do was particularly jam Pippen, who leads so many of the fast break opportunities. Portland over the foul limit. So Pippen to the foul line. Scotty Pippen telling us that the ankle and wrist injuries are behind him. He finished the... Cleveland Series. Hey, Williams. Game six on Friday night. And Richfield had an up and down series against the New York Knicks and then turned it up against the Cavaliers. Bill Cartwright replaced by Scott Williams. So Cartwright departs. Scott Williams making his presence felt against the Cavaliers. Played very well. Had two very strong games. And Mar Bill Cartwright was him. not happy. When he saw that uh, Scott Williams was coming in for him, he really got upset. Six and a half remaining in this first quarter. To this point, the game has been played at the Blazers' tempo. It's tempo. Oh, wow. Tip by the Chicago. Oh. I thought Chicago tipped it in. Well, he may have got the easiest two points of his career right there because I would have given it to Chicago, those two. I swear. The ball's only two of 11 from the field. Jordan again. Mike said, you ain't finna keep disrespecting me. You ain't, you ain't finna keep disrespecting me staying back like that. Point land. Most unusual to see Michael bombing away. That's his third three-point attempt. He finally hits. Well, Marv, Clyde Drexler is enticing him to shoot it. 
Oh my lord. Uh oh. What a stray. Boils now with Paxson and Jordan in the backcourt. Williams and Grant and Pippen up front. Now Jordan posting up. Goes to the front. And one. Okay, Mike. I see you. I see you, big dog. Anytime it wants to during the course of a season, they didn't use it much in the regular season. But in the I see you, big dog. More and more the post up of Michael Jordan. Hey, he's their best post up player. And you know, during the playoff, you must change your game. So they have changed their game, utilizing Michael Jordan's skill in the post. Balls again go to the pressure. Hey, this Terry Porter ain't no joke, dog. So the playoffs has been in what can be labeled the he hit him coming off a subpar regular season. He is really easy. Nah, Terry. Nah. Nah, I'm out of here, dog. Nah, Terry lethal. Tick. Oh, my. Terry Porter. Somebody put that man out. That man is on fire, dog. He is in fuego. My Jesus. He keep putting that foot on the line, though. Get that foot back. And then go and make the play. So good presence of mind to get back on defense even after the jump shot. If there are a couple factors that may play big in this entire series, it's turnovers and quick shots. No. With a quick shot. on the follow -up. Good look. Nice pass for Robinson. Robinson. Yeah. Yay. Just under five minutes to go. And this first quarter. With the czar of the telescreen, Mike Fratello, along with Patrick Johnson and Ahmad Rashad. Good D. Good shot. I don't know how he made it, but good shot. Chicago, 17. I was about to say, good call. Good call. Hey, Terry Porter, the real deal. Hey, hey, Paxi, you might be seeing an even more lethal sniper than you are, my guy. We might be seeing it because he coming down, pulling up our fast break. Uh, defensive shuffle coming up. Terry Porter has certainly had his way with John Paxson here. The early oh, everything. They're going to have to put Scotty and Mike on him, dog. Taking him down low inside. The guy's knocking out jump shots. That's facts. Anybody that gives him room. But what he's catching uh, Chicago is, is in their transition game, see? What you normally do against other teams is you suck back into the, the paint and then come out to uh, challenge guard. But against Portland, you can't do that. You must get your defense out front and then suck back in. Well, Phil Jackson now will go with B.J. Armstrong. John Paxson will sit down after picking up his second. Terry Porter grew up in Milwaukee. Did not start until his senior year at South Division High School in Milwaukee in college. Played center and both forward positions. He was a, a sleeper first round pick out of Wisconsin, Stevens Point. Lasers lead 25 17 as we come up on four minutes to go in the second quarter. Shot clock. Number five. What do we got, Scotty? Good look. Perfect pass, Scotty. Great shot, Mike. That three point was created off the penetration of Pippen. And uh, Drexler slept in to stop him. And uh, Michael was right there for the three. Uh, during the regular season, Michael Jordan hit only 27. What we got, Cliff? Robinson. And back comes Pippen. No. Good. Oh. Okay. Good. I was gonna say good head. You're saying that Michael Jordan. He feels. Five point game. He's gonna pull.
pull up and try That's to shoot crazy. in your face. He feels it right now in the playoffs. And then I he swear he's feeling it, dog. Long enough, okay, to let everybody know that he's got the stroke. Terry Porter. Get that foot up. Really God dang, he was going crazy. The, uh, Jesus. Again, he shot only 46 percent. Thirty. Somebody to step up their game if they were gonna get to this. Oh, point. we got Mike. He was the man who stepped up his game and Terry Porter. Oh, Jesus! And missed it, but he's taking them to this uh, point where they're at now with this great outside shooting. Danny Ainge has checked in for the first time. Robinson. Oh, checked his time. Saved by I saw the idea, but should have just shot it. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, Mike said I'm feeling myself now. Yeah. He said I'm feeling myself. Oh, three? Okay, Mike. Oh, you different today. Michael Jordan yesterday, in commenting about the comparisons with Clyde Drexler, said, yes, we're, we're even in every category, although someone said, how about three-point shooting? And Drexler looks for the three. Usually, whistle. For the offensive foul against Portland. <laughs> Look at Danny Ainge. Danny Ainge. Foul committed by Mark Bryant. And Jordan made the point. Well, I have not chosen to shoot three-point shots. As if to say, well, if I wanted to go that route. I'd be doing the same as Drexler. Well, he has chosen to look for the three here in the first quarter. I was about to say. Oh, my God, bro. He came out. Yeah, he said, I need to make a statement. Are hey, y'all going to stop comparing me to Clyde? That is stops today. He came out fire. Three or four in a row. Then Clyde knows he had to come up on him. So he sucked him in that time. Pump fake. The defense. For the uh, easy two-point jump shot. And you see Rick Adelman is shaking his head on the sideline. What he's thinking about is they are not coming to meet the basketball against the Chicago team. He can't wait for the ball to come to you. And one. Strong move by Kersey to draw the foul. The finish, Kersey. Kersey, the ability to put it on the floor and take it to the basket. One of the big pluses for this Trailblazer team. They have so many guys that can put it down and take their defenders off the dribble. That stopped a 10-2 run by Chicago. Sparked by Jordan, who has 16 points in this first quarter. Three-point play for Kersey. And it's Portland 28, Chicago 25. Two minutes remaining in the first. Oh, nice. Oh, my God. Jesus. Travel, yo. Now, nah, Mike's going stupid. Mike's going stupid. Look at that. Pull up. Oh my God. Uh oh. Uh oh. And charge. Good call. That's a good call. I agree. It's so those those calls are so hard. It's bang bang because it's like, did he establish himself before Clyde was in the upper motion? It's so close. Like those calls, you can argue either way, but I think it was a good call in this situation. But you can argue it either way. Yeah. I'm getting him off a of mic for sure. 
Yeah, I see Drake said just swipe down like he ain't got two fouls. Stop. I and mean, I'm definitely taking him off. Mike, you got to. Yeah, I need to get him up out of there. Get him up out of there for sure. Good pass, though, Mike. Ah, good hand. Chicago's hands are always there, dog. Out of the game. Knocked out by Armstrong. 13 on the 24. And Drexler will throw in. Angel Watley now in the backcourt. Bryant with Drexler Robinson up. Good block. That oh my God, Scotty! The Bulls by five, and you could see the excitement in BJ that time. He couldn't wait to get down the court, and then actually took a shot that was a little bit too quick. I'm sure. Yeah, it wasn't a good shot. Robinson. Cliff Robinson getting for all. Cliff's nice. Chicago has not seen very often in the playoff is a 30-point quarter for their basketball team. So they better be happy with the way they're scoring. Jordan. I was about to say. And time has run out. Uh, yeah, Mike was started going nuts in that first quarter, dog. Uh, Portland, I think this final is about to be a lot more fun to watch than the 91 finals, dog. Uh, because it's it looks like both teams should be explosive. You got Terry Porter coming out hot. You got, uh, I ain't seen too much from Jack. Seen a couple of plays, but not too much. Cliff Robinson looking pretty solid down there. Uh, it looks like they got a pretty decent team. You know what I'm saying? Then you just got Mike over here in Chicago. He said, all right, first quarter, let me go ahead and carry y'all. They don't think I can shoot threes? I got a point to prove. They compare me to Clyde? I got a point to prove. That's, uh, but that's all we got for this one. Make sure y'all subscribe. Ring notification bell. Get a video. Thumbs up. It's your boy, Daniel. Out.